Thanks a lot. We're on our way. Oh. Where are you going? Well, what do you think, honey? North? We've done north. How about west? That's an idea. But let's not lock ourselves in. You're right, honey. You mean you, you haven't made any plans? Oh, we never do. We just get in the car and go wherever. I'm glad I don't carpool with you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that sounds like fun, not having any plans, just winging it, being free as a bird. Honey, even birds pick a direction. <laughs> You'll have to excuse my husband. When he gets up in the morning, he checks off, got up. <laughs> well, there, you know, there isn't anything wrong with making plans. I mean, what, what if you, you drove to a city and uh, when you got there, all the, all the hotels had been booked? We'd probably end up in a place like this. <laughs> Well, you, uh, you wouldn't want that to happen again. <laughs> Why don't I uh, call ahead and make some reservations? Oh, for no, you? thanks. Oh, thanks anyway. We're fine. We had a great time. Uh, at, at, least, at least take a map. Crazy, reckless kids. <laughs> Dick, they're just being spontaneous. You could learn something from them. Joanna, I'm as spontaneous as the next guy. I've, uh, I've gone north. <laughs> Yeah, but never without your pals, Rand and McNally. Hi, there's nothing wrong with, with planning these things out. I mean, I, I prefer using a travel agent to, to flinging darts at a map. Boring. Careful. Dick, tell me the last time that you went to bed without having all your clothes laid out for the next day, or the last time you got something at the grocery store that wasn't on your list. Joanna, you, you can't compare responsible shopping with, with the driving hell-bent through Vermont. <laughs> Dick, just face it, you're not spontaneous and you never will be. Oh, really? <laughs> Had enough? <laughs> Michael, Stephanie, what happened? <laughs> Fuzzy? The Z. The Z was in a tiny accident. Tiny? My Z now looks like a W! <laughs> we had just dropped my car off for servicing, and we were driving home, and as usual, Michael couldn't take his eyes off me. And he smashed into a mailbox. It was Michael's fault. I mean, he did pick this outfit. <laughs> this is the first accident I've ever caused. Well, that I know of, anyway. Michael, you should be grateful that you and Stephanie are okay and only the car is damaged. Boy, Dick, it's a good thing Bambi had Thumper to comfort him and not you. <laughs> Come on, let's uh, take a look at it. Dick, it's hideous. It looks... domestic. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. What's going on? We're going to Quebec. We are? When did we decide this? Just now. <laughs> Call it a whim. Call it a lark. Call it spontaneous. Dick, are you serious? No, I, I thought about what you said, and, and you were right. I, I could be a, a little looser. Well, this is great. How'd you come up with Quebec? Tossed a dart at a map, how else? Oh, honey, honey, I am so proud of you. This is really great. Oh, it isn't, you know, it isn't that big a deal. Oh, I've got it. Let's go to Niagara Falls. No, Qu uh, Quebec. <laughs> they, they, even, they even speak a, a different language up there. It, it'll, it'll be nuts. <laughs> wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. What about California? Yeah, let's get on a plane uh, honey, and just Honey, honey, the, the dart has been cast. <laughs> We'll just get in the car and, and go to Quebec. Well, we could, but we've been there. Yeah, but n never like this. You know, not all of a sudden. A and besides, you know, it's, it's north. Yeah, but, Dick, I mean, why get stuck in one place? I mean, as long as we're doing this without any plans, and that is what we're doing, right? Right. Dick, why are you so set on Quebec? Because that's, um, 
That's kind, that's kind of uh, <coughs> that's kind of kind of what the, re the reservations are. The what? The reservations are. Uh, honey, there, I mean, there's nothing wrong with, with making reservations for a hotel. You know, just to be to be absolutely sure. Oh, Dick, uh, about this itinerary, I can't read where you're going to be tomorrow at two thirty. <laughs> Is she? Oh, she's doing fine. You can tell me. They put her on a lift. <laughs> Michael. Michael. Oh, step. You wax them, you polish them, you change their oil, and then something like this happens. She's going to be okay. Well, we do have a specialist. Uh, Arnie is supposed to be the best fender and chrome man in the business. I'm sure he is. I wanted to stay, but they said they could work faster if they didn't have to keep prying me off the hood. <laughs> oh, Michael. You know I'm sorry about your Z, but boy, is that your loner out there? Michael, did you get your new car? Uh, it's just temporary, Steph. Well, I don't see it. It sits out there. Where? Over by the trash cans. The only thing over there is a big, red, ugly truck. <laughs> Ew! Steph, that's all they had. Oh. Hey, some guys have all the luck. I had to get a loaner once. They made me take a little foreign car. Couldn't haul a thing in it. <laughs> Michael, do you mind if I go out and take a closer look? Oh, go ahead. Oh, boy. <laughs> Michael, if you think you're hauling me around in that thing, well, you can just take your head in for servicing. <laughs> when are you getting the sea back? We have the Dartmouth dance, the fashion show, our open tea roof drive through town and our new sweaters. Well, Steph, don't worry. The Z's going under the torch this afternoon. Oh, why couldn't it have been me? <laughs> Ch Joanna? Come, come on. Come, come on, we're, we're going on a trip. <laughs> Who is it? it? It's me, come on. Dick, it's either the middle of the night or my eyes are still closed. Either way, I'm not moving. C come on, Joanna. Wh where are we going? I don't know. <laughs> w when are we coming back? I, I, I don't know. Dick, if you let me sleep, I'll let you make all sorts of reservations in the morning. <laughs> Joanna, you wanted me to be spontaneous. <laughs> you got it. Come on, we'll, we'll go with the, the clothes on our backs. We're in pajamas. Oh, all right. Okay, we'll go with the clothes on our backs in, in, a, in a few minutes. And, and I, I won't even wear the clothes that I, I laid out. I'll, I'll wear a... Uh, I'll... I'll wear these. No, okay. I'll, I'll go with the clothes I laid out. And Dick, this time no reservations? Only if we cross through Navajo territory. <laughs> Like that. Uh, we'll leave George and Stephanie a note, but we won't sign it. Ah! <laughs> You're a nutball. I love it. <laughs> oh, this is going to be great. <laughs> Did I tell you? to do here is look at this as an adventure. For the last 15 hours, we changed the tire, we've been rained on, we've been stuck in mud, and we put 300 miles on the car without moving an inch. Dick. And then we ran out of gas. Dick, I know all of this. Please it's... let me go on, Joanna. I like reliving it. <laughs> and then that road. Oh, why don't we see where this leads? <laughs> well, this is where it leads, Joanna. Hotel hell. <laughs> I can't believe I let you talk me into this. Dick, I did not talk you into this. This was your idea. I never even, I never even, even thought of being spontaneous and, and, until you mentioned it. Well, we're here now, somewhere in New Hampshire. 
Let's just make the best of it. Besides, I I'm not having a bad time. Yes, you are. This is a bad time, Joanna. This is the standard by which all other bad times will be judged. You need a room? Yes. No. Dick. I'm not going to stay in the sleazebag motel. Dick, we're tired. We're mud caked. How, how far is the next motel? Ten miles. I'm game to push. How about you? No way. What happened to Miss Positive Sunshine Face? She wants a shower, she wants a bed, and she wants them now. All right, well, we'll take a room. You want it for the full hour? <laughs> no, we want it for the full night. Sure. <laughs> Look, we're married. We just want a place to sleep. Yeah, right. Do you have a reservation? <laughs> for this? Phil, didn't you ever pick up and, and, and go willy-nilly? You know, with, with no plans, just hit the road free as a bird? What are you, some kind of beatnik? <laughs> no. Seems crazy driving around in the middle of the night without an itinerary. Look, we, we just want a room f for the night, or, or, or in your language, eight one hours. <laughs> We're full. What? Hey, uh, you don't exactly look like you're up to the level of my usual clientele. Dick, do something. Give him some money. Phil, I, uh, I think I know what's going on here. <laughs> do you have any money? Here, why don't you charge yourself a nice bribe? <laughs> I'm thinking maybe the bed came first. <sighs> Honey, do you think they let whales stay here? Probably, if they have reservations. <laughs> Well, Miss, aren't we having fun is back. Come on, honey. We're inside. We're warm. We got a nice big bed, and I think the police left. Yeah, and the guy they took with them has nicer lodgings than we do tonight. Come on, Dick. Just try and relax. Hey, let me roll that cake in here. All right, all right. Don't, don't forget the pretzels. <laughs> Well, now all I need is a high-speed drill in my molar and I can really kick back. Why don't we watch some TV? I'm going to try and get some sleep. Are you sure you're doing it right? Hey, let's carve our names in the mattress! Maybe we should call Phil. No. Just hope the doorknob works in the morning. Hey, you want to keep it down? We're trying to party in here! Hey, come on, everybody! Let's go see!
see if we can find our clothes. Oh, what's wrong? <laughs> Go to sleep fast. Hi, I'm Roy. Phil said we have to share. <laughs> We only have time for a quick compliment and then we have to go. You look incredible. Okay, let's go. Oh, Steph, wait. I, uh, I still don't have the Z. What? Well, there were some complications. Don't worry. She's going to be fine. One of the retractable headlights is, is sticking. But with your car in the next bay, it looks like they're, they're flirting. So what are we going to the dance in? Guess what this starts. You still have that? Steph, it won't be so bad going in big red. Ew, Michael, you named it. Well, Steph, it's dark. I got rid of the burlap, and when was the last time we tuned into AM radio? Oh, Michael, I refuse to ride in any vehicle I have to step up into. Okay, Steph, I guess uh, we just won't go. I guess we won't make our grand entrance or our grand exit. And... We won't be doing this. Oh, Michael. You know how much better it is when people are watching? <laughs> Besides, Steph, it's not what you drive, it's what you wear. Michael, do you really believe that? You bet. <laughs> It is what you drive. I know, I know. <laughs> wow, you guys look great. Where are you going? The couch. Boy, I guess I really underdressed for the lobby. <laughs> Does this mean you guys won't be going out tonight? Then you won't be needing Big Red? <laughs> you want to take her for a spin, George? You mean it? Just get it away from here. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Oh, gee, thanks, Michael. When I get back, I'll let you know what I hauled. I'm sorry, it's a, it's a bad dream. Maybe I'll try to go back to it. We should have just stayed in the motel room. Yeah, and, uh, and waited for Roy to come back and join us? No thanks. He fixed the TV set, Dick. I don't care. Well, I still don't know why you had to throw his duffel bag out the window was a spontaneous decision. I thought that's what this trip was all about. Dick, stop it now. I'm tired of hearing you complain. You haven't said one good thing about this whole trip. All right. Most of it is behind us. Dick. Admit it. We would have been better off if we had planned this trip like, like we usually do. In fact, I'm, I'm making some plans right now and I'm writing them down. A, get gas. <laughs> B, go home. C, report Phil to some commission. Okay, Dick, being spontaneous didn't work out this time, but I mean, it can be great. Well, I, I'm really never going to find out because this is my last madcap hurrah. <laughs> Oh, oh, look at that sunrise. It's, it's incredible. It's beautiful. I mean, I've, I've never seen that color. It, it's, not, it's not really red. 
it's, it's not really orange, it's... orange. Now admit it, honey. You wouldn't have planned on getting up at 5 a.m. to see this, would you? No, probably not. Oh, it's beautiful. I've seen better. We'll be right back on New Heart, next on Nick at Night. Try and stop me.